On January 16, 2020, the General Secretary of the MPP, John Buedu, announced that the party will officially open nomination for persons seeking to go to Parliament on the party's ticket in the 2020 election. As already determined, we are holding the parliamentary primaries on Saturday, April 25th, 2020, in all our 169 constituency except one constituency, that is Ayawaso West Wagon constituency. Nomination shall be open on Monday, January 20, 20, 2020, and closed on Thursday, February 20, 2020. Per our constitution, in our parliamentary uh, 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 selection process, you open nomination for one month, and this is exactly what we are going to do. So, opening nomination is January 20, 2020. And this nomination shall be open for one month. That is, end on Thursday, February 2020. This is the second leg of the party's primaries after the one held in the 106 orphan constituencies in September of 2019. This time around, the elections are being held in 169 constituencies across the country where the party has certain members of parliament. Already, some big names have declared their intention to contest the April 25th election. Deputy Chief of Staff at the Office of the President, Francis Asenso Boache, is lacing his boot for the Bantaman constituency. He is seeking to oust the incumbent Member of Parliament for the area, Daniel Ochem Abwaji, who has been in Parliament for only four years. The CEO of the National Entrepreneur and Innovation Programme, John Kuma, has also declared his intention to contest the Ejeso seat. He's seeking to oust the incumbent member of parliament for the area, Kwabna Uwusu Edwini. Others include the executive secretary of the Free Zones Authority, Michael Kofi Berfi, who has his eyes on the new job in South Seat. This will be a contest to watch as he comes against the formidable Dr. Esibe Yeboa, the chairman of the Finance Committee of Parliament. The contest for the Yendi seat will be one to watch closely as two government appointees are chasing that slot. Coco Boss, Deputy Procurement Boss, and son of former Vice President Alaji Ali Mahama, has an interest for the seat. Farouk Ali Mahama will be battling it out with the Deputy Maslok CEO Abiba to Salamam Zakaria to unseat the incumbent Member of Parliament for the area, Mohamed Habib Tijani, who is the Deputy Minister of Foreign Affairs. Deputy Minister for Regional Reorganization and Development, Martin J. Mensa Corsa, has his eyes on the Techima North constituency and he will be making an attempt to unseat the incumbent member of parliament for the area. Henry Yeboah Yadon Bwachi.